hello 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 welcome back guys to my youtube channel if you're seeing this video if you're seeing the screen then you know which video we're gonna talk about yes we're gonna continue our requirement analysis but today i'm not gonna take a new college and do a requirement analysis because our next four videos were already planned so as usual today as i told you in the last video i will make a video about university of padawan how to apply via uniasis and that will be our two subsequent university videos today i will just jump into university of padawan internal website check for the course that we are applying and how it is applying what are the admission criteria and other things then we will jump into uniasis then register for the uniasis then in the second part of the video we will fill the mandatory details as usual then we will submit the application this is what we have planned for two videos and let's get started also if you're new to this channel then don't forget to like share and subscribe and also please share these videos with the people who are in it so that they can also look into these videos and apply for themselves then they can end up in master studio uh, master studies in in, in, uh, in german without any ado we'll get started so if you if you guys remember this was the video that we made or this was the link that we used to do a requirement analysis for master of computer engineering padabon university in the last video but here we got to know that the requirement registration everything then we have to apply via uni assist and the application deadline for summer semester is in 30th november okay that's the reason we will jump into the uh, padabon university website so first maybe i will jump into here so if you click on padabon university you will be in padabon university web page maybe you can just check into english website then it will be easy for you to uh, look after then you can click on studies and you can click on international students and other uh, courses as soon as you're here then you are uh, you are having degree seeking students and Eng uh, english thought master degrees so these are the things that we are looking for english thought master degrees so you can click on english dot master degrees and you can just see these are the nine courses that are offered in english in padaman university which will be computer science computer engineering electrical system engineering in uh, english and american literature literacy international economics and management physics uh, up to electronics material science and applied neuroscience so these are the nine courses that they are offering but if you remember the requirement analysis that we have done is for i think computer engineering yes we have done it for computer engineering so that's the reason we will check into computer engineering but as i told you as we are applying through uni assist if you are looking for application procedure for computer science and electrical engineering and don't want to wait until i do it will be the same procedure you just have to select the other other uh, course that's it but the filling of the application will be same in uni assist we can go inside the computer engineering which we are usually look for and as i told you we have go through requirement analysis complete but here we can just go through on a glance so the computer engineering is msc which is four semester course and starts in both summer and winter and language of study is complete english and it is one uh, 120 ects selection procedure is free admission they say so we can also look for what does it mean so what does admission restricted or admission free mean so restricted admission means a limited number of place will be there and see numerous clauses close number but free admission means there are sufficient available degree program all applicants therefore receive an acceptance letter if you have guaranteed enrollment if you have all requirement which you have done so free admission means if you have all requirement fulfilled then you will get admission so there is no restricted amount of seat it is like numerous amounts of seats are there other than that what are the structure of the course so be beside co completing mandatory modules in computer science and electrical engineering student has to specialize in one of the focus area so after getting into this degree you will choose any of the one specialization here so you can choose about whichever things that you want to pursue i did it on embedded system in my university of stuttgart but here you can just choose a along with these six types of things then internship there is no mandatory internship we also got to know that if there is no mandatory internship then it's fine but you can also take a urlop semester and do a extra internship by yourself and these are the normal things that we were looking for but if you just go back and apply for application roadmap and you can just see here application for admission and deadlines for international applicants so self check entry requirements is done in dart we already did it as a previous step as we have done a requirement analysis in dart itself then select a study of course we have selected and we can also requirements we found it already and do you need to apply via uniasis yes or directly uniasis check the application group so we checked it so we have to apply via uniasis group so prepare your documents and apply via deadline so we will first check the respective deadlines so i think deadlines will be the same as i told you it will be 30th november until so we will directly jump into uniasis and he this is the uniasis website where we are using to 
show you how to apply for Padebon University. So this is the UNICEF's website. The university which gonna use is Padebon. So then the type of degree would be Masters. Then you can click on search. As soon as you clicked on search, you can just see there are so many numerous amount of courses that are offering. So here we are applying applying for computer engineering and computer engineering master of science. So the one thing would be the both are looks same, but you can select the one which is here the computer engineering this was chemical engineering i got confused but yeah select on computer engineering and click on select and as soon as you clicked on select you have to sign in so if you are new to this sign in page then please click on create a new then fill in all details email re, uh, your repeated your email then password and uh, re, re enter your passport after that you can click on uh, create an account as soon as you click on create an account it will ask you the basic details that you want to fill in what are your educational background where you come from what is your address when, when is your born date and what is the document that you are using as a identity card like passport or anything so these are the things that you need to fill after filling that you can create an account as soon as you create an account you will get a login credential to your mail forwarded then you can use that login with it change the password afterward so this whole procedure is already made a video into three different parts please look it out and check out how to set up your union assist and other things in my youtube channel now i will just sign in and let you know and so now you can, if you can see i have filled all mandatory details and i'll click on uh, sign in and you can see i will select the computer engineering course and the course has been selected so if it is not asking for which the which course you are jumping for or which semester then it is directly selected for first semester then we will remove the ingolstadt one which we have made and the first application that we're gonna do apply is computer engineering so this was the first part of the video that i wanted to tell you or talk to you about how the structure applies and how the uh, summer semester look like and if you are people who are in urgent need, I will in the next video, I will explain how to fill in the details. But I will just scroll through the details that I have filled. Please look for the details. If you are hurry in the applying up video in the first part only, then please pause the video and fill in the details. Without knowing, then in the next part, I will show you how to apply completely and how to fill it and with the reasoning. But now people who are in urgent of applying, then they can use the uh, thing. So this was the first part of the video then in this in the second part of the video i will show you how to answer the mandatory questions in detail and i will give you the explanation why we are filling the those things so until then watch this first video get ready with your application if you are in the verge of applying already then please fill in the details as i told you at like i showed you at the last just pause the video and fill in the details you can just understand what i have filled or if you are don't know then please look into other video where i have showed you how to apply via unisys it will be the same unanswered mandatory questions that i gonna use but if you still want to wait for me then I, my video will be out on monday the second part then see you on monday take care have a nice day bye bye